in this video, I'm gonna share with you kung ano yung materials na ginagamit ko para ituro ang religion sa akin 2-year-old, 4-year-old, and 8-year-old. Hello, Pinoy homemakers! I am Kat, a homeschool mom of three kids here in the Philippines. And in this channel, we share our homeschool journey, the materials that we use, and the realities of homeschooling. So, kung bago ka lang sa channel na please click the subscribe button and the bell para ma-notify ka ng mga new videos. One of our main reasons to homeschool our kids is for us to teach them the values that we have. So, uh, importante kasi sa amin na matulungan sila ng tamang asal, uh, magkaroon ng moral compass, and uh, by teaching them religion, we are helping them learn more about uh, our faith and for them to know what is right and what is wrong. So, for young kids, um, Una-una, pinakailangan niya talaga, lalo na kayo ay Christian or Catholic, is the Bible. Okay? So, yung mga bata kasi, hindi pa naman nila masyadong naiintindihan ang story ng Bible dahil kahit naman yung mga matatanda, hindi naiintindihan rin yung story ng Bible. So, I will suggest you get them um, kid-friendly Bibles. Ito, gift sa amin ito. So, maganda siya. Mayroon mga illustrations and short stories dun sa Bible. So, read this to your kids. And meron din mga nabibili mga books na uh, hiwa-hiwala yung story, ah. Tulad nito. Ito, yung Osborne Bible Tales. Ito, nabili ko to sa sale ng uh, warehouse sale ng Scholastic. Ayan. So, alam ko meron pa kang iba doon. Ito makuda. Mga lima ata yung ganito na amin. Maganda rin kasi yung mga ano, illustrations niya. Tapos, so very simple lang yung mga sentences para mas madali maintindihan ng mga bata. And then for preschoolers, I used this with Kuya V. Ito, the hands-on Bible curriculum for age 5 and 6 is for preschooler. Uh, meron siyang Bible story time. Tapos, meron uh, prayer time. Meron siyang mga activities. Ayan siya, oh. Maganda siya. Nabili ko to, pre-love. I forgot kung saan ko siya nabili eh. Pero, nagamit namin to ni Kuya V. Nung 5 uh, uh, years old siya. Nung kinder siya. Na. And now na, ano siya? Grade 3 na. Uh, we are using textbooks then as our references tulad na to for grade 3. Ayan. So, ito yung ginagamit niya. Ngayon, for this school year. We have also added a subscription of Mastard. Ito. Uh, sowing Seeds of Fun and Faith. Yeah, this is from Kerygma Books. You can get it online from their website, shop.kerygmabooks.com. And mura lang siya for a year. Um, nagbayad lamang ako ng 350 pesos, you know, for one year subscription. This is a great uh, book for grade schoolers. Meron siya dito every Sunday kasama yung gospel. Yeah, sinasama nila yung gospel every Sunday. Meron din sila dito uh, pieces about the Bible. Yan. Bible readings. Meron mga games like word search. Uh, meron din mga stories about saints. Yan. So, if you're a Catholic, you would appreciate this. And meron din siyang mga other articles about faith. And maganda kasi sinishare Nagsishare din yung mga other kids. Yan. Natutuwa ako dito. Kasi pag nababasa ng anak ko to, na-realize niya, ay, I'm just like other kids. <laughs> so, meron rin siya mga different activities. We are also planning to get a catechism book. Pero for now, wala pa siya dito sa akin. We'll get him that catechism book para mas maturuan pa namin siya about our faith and in preparation for his first Holy Communion that will happen first quarter of next year. So, I'll be giving out a one-year subscription of Master Magazine to a lucky subscriber and viewer of this channel. So, all you have to do is like this video, comment down below ano yung name ng anak mo at ilang taon na siya, and don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Ayan. So, simple lamang po yung ating mechanics. And I'll announce the winner on November 15 sa aking mga social media accounts on Facebook and Instagram. So, tignan ninyo. Uh, make sure that you follow me as well on Facebook and Instagram para malaman ninyo at makita ninyo kung sino yung mananalo ng one-year subscription ng magazine ng Mustard. Yan! 
Thank you again for watching and I hope na meron kayo natutunan sa video na to. Kung meron man, please hit the like button and comment down below ano yung pinaka-favorite nyo na material para ituro sa inyong kids, ang tungkol sa inyong faith. Don't forget to subscribe and share yun na rin itong video to sa mga friends ninyo. Thank you and we'll see you in our next video.